Okay, we are here in the Kenai Peninsula at the airport and we're fixing to go up to the top of a mountain site where I just learned that the actual site, it's not a site, it's an actual meat truck. So this should be very interesting. So we're excited to check it out. So follow us. All right, looks like our ride's here, so this should be fun. <laughs> One of the things I was amazed by was just how beautiful Alaska really is. There's no video that can do it justice. The landscape is just simply amazing. But still, I keep thinking about the site we are visiting. How did they get a meat truck to the top of the mountain? And more importantly, who thought that this would be a good idea for a radio shelter? I can't wait to get there to see this. Well, <laughs> we made it. <laughs> it's uh, it's kind of cold up here because if you look, there's snow up here at this site. So this should be really interesting. We'll see what we're about to get into and uh, we're gonna check out this site, so it should be fun. So this is the site and as you can see, it's definitely a meat truck. When you look closer, you can see the wheels have been taken off and they are using it for communication. What I don't seem to understand is, you know, how they got this to the top of the mountain. And I've asked others and they don't seem to know either. So we're gonna go in, we're gonna take a look and see what's actually inside the meat truck and see what type of radio equipment they have housed in there. But it's really cool because like the antenna is like just shooting down into the valley. So it's really good. Can you get a picture of this, Dennis? I did. Okay, thank you. Now you're recording. So on your scale of ghetto installations, where does this rank? Uh, I mean, it's, it's up there. It's not the worst we've seen. <laughs> I mean, you don't see a meat truck too often for a site here. You see the beef above the I was gonna say, slide. this is the classic, uh, don't yeah. stack them above the slide. Yeah, don't stack the beef above the slide. Stock. Well, so you can keep the stock from the meat truck. So there you have it, an actual meat truck. I am so glad I had the opportunity to see this.